So when you've logged into Witson Plus, you'll get this overview of all the fields that you have databased in the platform. As a general note, probably the most important thing that you'll learn uh, about the software uh, and all web-based uh, tools is that if you, if you are experiencing any type of bug or issue, or if it looks like your page isn't loading correctly, etc., feel free to use the control R uh, shortcut on your uh, keyboard, which is the same as clicking the refresh button up here to the left, okay? So control R, and clicking this one is exactly uh, the same. And what it does is that it, it provides you with a hard refresh of what you see on the page uh, in front of you. And many times that solves your uh, issue. In terms of uh, support elsewise, if you need help, the best way to get help is to use the ticketing system up here uh, to the right. Uh, so if you're experiencing a bug, if you have a technical question, if you just have a user feedback or in terms of functionality, or if you want to see some new functionality, feel free to use this uh, form. All that uh, those messages are provided or, or uh, will provide the software team with a, um, a uh, Slack notification and also an email, and you have a dedicated resource that will help with your issue immediately. Uh, you can also send an email to support at witson.com, um, uh, you know, asking about any uh, question. Uh, and of course, if you have a dedicated uh, kind of Witson employee that you like to to uh, talk to, you can, of course, ask that person directly as well. If you're inside of a particular feature and would like to know more about the technical details uh, associated with that feature, it's very handy to use the use a manual shortcut right here. So if you click the user manual, you're brought straight into the exact part of the manual that discuss, discusses this feature, okay? So you saw now I was inside of PBT and fluid definition and it brought me straight into the fluid definition part of the manual. And it describes all the bells and whistles re related to this feature, okay? Uh, the other thing that you can see here is that the hierarchy of uh, the modules here in the manual is exactly the same as what you see here in the navigation panel to the left. So it should be very easy to navigate both inside of the software and inside of the manual um, when it comes to features and information about those features. The uh, other shortcut here, which is very helpful, is this uh, opportunity to change units. So here we can change to uh, SI metric or SI metric Canada, which is just uh, using KPA instead of bars. Uh, and then when it comes to zooming and, and uh, providing you with enough real estate on the screen, it can be helpful to know that you can, of course, zoom in and out here to the top right of the browser to something that makes more sense in terms of uh, how you visually like to look at things on the screen. Uh, another shortcut, if you want to remove the navigation panel, you can click the hamburger menu here, just next to the Witson Plus um, icon. And if you even want more real estate than that, you can click F11 on your keyboard. And what that provides you with is an opportunity to maximize and minimize the uh, screen that you see uh, in front of you.